The first step to systemizing your business is to understand what's working currently and what isn't. And the way I recommend that you find that out is to map your customer journey, your operational journey from start to finish. Not your marketing journey, start from when the customer, the potential customer first contacts you or you contact them so that there is communication, there is an interaction. And then map out your journey. A great way to do this is with your key team around you using a roll of brown paper, using swim lanes, a swim lane for each area of your business, starting with the client at the top, then perhaps the chief exec, the business owner, then the marketing sales team, then whoever, the teams that you've got or the people that you've got if you're just a small team. And then using post-it notes, map out every tiny detail of your journey and really get into the detail, really dig into, okay, the phone is answered. Who answers the phone? How do they answer the phone? What information do they capture? How is that information captured? How is it passed to the most relevant person? Is it post-it notes or do we have a template? Is it collected straight into our CRM? Really thinking about how each particular step could be done better. What you're looking for is inefficiency. You're looking for duplications or two different people doing the same task. You're looking for duplication of data. Is the data entered here and then re-entered here and then re-entered here? How are things working right now? And you work right the way through that journey. You're looking for all of the interactions with your customers, but you're also looking at what, everything that's going on behind the scenes. What exactly, exactly are your team doing? And is it done as well as it could be? Is it as consistent as it could be? So mapping your customer journey gives your whole team a really good big picture view of how the whole operation works, but it also gives you really clear information about what's working well now, what isn't, what isn't as good as it could be, and what do you need to fix? What are the opportunities to make this journey really simple and streamlined? That's the name of the game. So I highly encourage you, get your team together. You can also do this online, obviously, if you have a remote team using the likes of Lucidchart, just mapping your swim lane diagram. But do it because it will give you such clarity about how your business currently operates. And of course, if you want any help, you know where I am. I'd be happy to do it with you. So that's step one. If you're looking for more tips, skills and strategies to help you systemize your business and make it more consistent, then please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Use the button below.